I suppose we are off. Somewhere. I don't know. Oop. Nice. Oh, sorry. I was just rushing over to tell everyone the bridge over the West River is complete. Okay. Boko might still be over in that cave to the west. Boko. Oh, he's my price, Chocobo. And my best friend. Oh, really? What, you don't believe me? Well, you're so poor at riding wind drakes. It, it, it's, it's a fightless Chocobo. Oh, take this. Yeah. They really are like siblings. I can't win against this kid. Oh, oh smart. I would have had a separate save uh, between all of those, but... Uh, oh, well. They also cleared out the... Meter right that was there. Is it me, or is the geography around here a bit different? Or am I just too used to, like, going quickly over this terrain? Oh! Shiboko. Hello, I'm Cryo. Huh? You speak Chugabo too? Just a little. I think he wants to introduce us to someone. For real? This is his wife. Her name's Coco, of course. Boko Yi stud you. Listen, Boko, I've got a favor to ask. He says he already knows. What? He says you're leaving on another journey, right? Boko, is that okay? I know you got the little woman and all. What's he saying? He says he loves her. Slick. Dad, while he's away to take care of the babies. The babies? <laughs> I think Boko was busy. Coco has little ones on the way. She says she'll be waiting here for him. Coco, thanks. Uh, don't worry, we'll, we'll be back safe. sure what a chocobo can do that we can't especially a flightless one. <laughs> oh yeah I guess over to yeah. right hmm. everything feels so uh merged Just keep exploring. Because this I couldn't reach before. Yeah, it's. Mm. What? What? Eh? Did I leave that there? Here's a village. Pretty advanced, huh? Uh, okay. Did you hear? They found Tycoon's missing missing princesses. This is. I suddenly felt dizzy when it came to everything around the village had completely changed. Some strange cavern appeared in the west. I heard tell that there was some mutant turtle in there. Turtle Sage? I 
There's some big bash going on at the Castle Tycoon. I wonder if they let me in. No. Oof, this wears you out. Some folks saw a ship with propellers down south at the bird-shaped peninsula. I wonder what the heck it is. Yeah, sh sure is a thing. It's to have, like, introductory <laughs> gear here. Uh... Pretty sure that was old text. Doesn't the land look different to you? Eh. Hey, it sure is green. B bits of, uh. Good ground, I guess. I can't believe Princess Sarisa was leading a bunch. a band of pirates! Uh, Mr. Uh, Miss Ferris, or whatever she was calling herself, what a shock. Still, it's wonderful that both princesses are safely back at the castle. Chance have any new uh, adventure magics, would ya? No? Okay. Uh, and nothing really new. Besides, uh, something to the west and the boat that we saw already. Oh, yeah, the, the turtle. Um, I, can, can I reach that? Writing so fast. What? Boko, I say this is all your fault. What do you mean? Don't take it out on him. There's nothing he could have done. Oh. Arts, what's that? Yeah, well, what, what, what is that? To ain't lion. Uh, well, I'm assuming they'll be like weak to, uh, I don't know, uh, ice. was the uh, best option. I already kind of missed the rest, the rest of the party right now. <laughs> I kind of mean very. Okay. 
stuck in a monster's nest. Great. Just great. I don't think it's very great at all. Now what, what do we do? What what do we do? I don't know. I don't know. Guess we'll just have to repaint <laughs> Coco uh Boboco and uh but purple paint and then we'll uh we'll just bring on out of here. Pretty muncular music right there. Do you promise never to try and pull something like that again? What? Waiting to admit you are wrong and try to make try to make it out be? <laughs> Alright. Oh. Come on, get up here. when we decided to maroon me back there. <laughs> Try that again. You'll, you'll swing from a yard arm. <laughs> but what happened? Why'd you come back after us? I'm just not cut out to be a princess, I'm afraid. Priority's much more my style. It is. I didn't do. What now? Ah. What's wrong? Oh, I think I got a splinter. Don't worry about it. Just uh, rip it straight through. It'll be like that one episode of Spongebob that everyone loves. Okay, well, it's nice having uh, some more front lines with us now. Uh, there's that cave. That's the only thing I can do right now. Yeah. Okay, so we just have to wait here. Get uh, some MP back. Watch, it'll probably be like a, a nice good water inside the cave, and I just wasted a tent. So yeah, I have the ability to run. Oh yeah, this is this the sages? Oh, <laughs> fell over. Ido. Hell you. Oh, thank you. I suppose you could be helpful after all. The shock of the two worlds merging sent everything topsy turvy. Including me. I'm a bit too old to do much on my back, I... Irv? Well, I don't know what that word was. What do you mean, worlds emerging? I see you're just as slow on uptake as before. It's an ancient legend, but I had never imagined it was true. According to legend, a thousand years ago, Bart's world and Cryo's world were one and the same. It seems there's quite the echo in here. <laughs> but, but why did the world split? The sea would avoid. Void. I fear no matter how I fear no matter how often I allude to your ignorance, my dry wit just goes over your head. So I will just simply explain. Please. <laughs> One thousand years ago, 
there existed a presence of the strongest evil. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, oh, <laughs> words. Oh, oh no. Oh, okay, cool. Uno possessed the power to control the void. After a long and harrowing battle, the people were able to defeat Uno with the 12 legendary weapons. Is that even how you're supposed to pronounce that? Am I, am I being dumb? Let me see. Let's ask Google. Uh, oh. Anuo. Anuo. Okay, cool. However, the void that Anuo had created could not be erased. As a last resort, the people split the crystals into two. To maintain balance, the world split into two as well. The void was sealed within the space between the two worlds, the interdimensional rift. I mean, Textef was telling the truth. He really did want to return the world to how it used to be. However, without the crystals, the wind's power would never return, nor would that of earth, fire, or water. My splinter really hurts. Uh. Oh, what? Xdev. I turned myself into a tiny splinter waiting for just this moment. Okay. Make you understand my true goal. To take the sealed power of the void for my own. What? Why do you think I emerged the worlds together? I don't know. <laughs> Mode 7. Ugh. Oh, now that, the, now that the two worlds are one, the interdimensional rift the void was sealed within is appearing as well. Wait, wait so, so in plain English, you're saying that the this void, uh, whatever nod is coming here? Yes. The Void shall be released from its thousand-year prison and into my keeping. The matchless power of the Void will be mine. Oh no. Not a chance, Hexdev. Look, the turtle again. No! They're gonna drown! Castle Tycoon. Lana! Beautiful, beautiful. Look, gaze upon the unlimited power of the void. Watch as it engulfs all in its path. And soon, it will belong to me. Anna, next to you. Oh. Is no one gonna uh, save the drowning turtle? Guess not. Peons, tremble before my might. Uh. Time for your Vicera to see the light of day. That that uh, that that the word. Now die. Okay. Ah, <laughs> I see. We found a, a, the entity that's gonna replace Lena, uh, the the turtle. <laughs> the sage turtle. Why? Why? What? Why is, it, why is it keeping up with that stuff? Not bad for a reptile. I think I sat around seven centuries munching on pizza. Pizza. Perhaps he should have taken a chance. Shall find no such tasty diversions in the afterlife. Peons, crumble before my might. Uh, I mean, all you did was just toss people around. 